Hey, how's it going everybody? Sarasota Tim coming to you from inside my Wolf Pub camper here in beautiful Boynton Beach, South Florida. And man, am I excited about the video I'm bringing for you today. I'm going to be 65 years old in December and I have to get Medicare. And Medicare is something that can be confusing and it's actually quite simple. Hopefully today I can give you a very simple way of understanding it, which way that will give you cause to think about what decision you're going to make if you're approaching or if you would even like to switch, which you can do every year on open enrollment. Even if you wanted to keep the same thing you got, maybe the rates have come down because maybe the rates have gone up in the last couple of years on the plan that you have and you would like to stay with the same plan but just have someone else another insurance company sell it to you because the plans are the same they have to be the same they cannot change the coverages will not change only the price you pay somebody but many people go years after getting on Medicare and never even call uh, their broker to say hey can you shop and see if my G plan or my N plan is any less with someone else in my area so here's the deal i gotta try to make this video quick and simple and viral <laughs> because really this is amazing what i have learned you gotta understand i'm not a broker i'm not an insurance salesman i'm your regular joe like you that has to pay for it and has to make this decision so i went on youtube and i started watching uh, youtubers that sell Medicare and what this plan is versus that plan and what does that plan cost and all that and while plans do cost differently in Florida where I live versus New York California Kentucky wherever there is a general price and while a few states can be very expensive we will stay with the average price okay in our example today I'm gonna to use Florida which is not the cheapest all right so you're 65 you got your Social Security going already they mail you your Medicare card and it's called a and B and you go to the doctor anywhere in America that accepts Medicare and you're good to go and 80% of your bill is gonna be paid but wait a minute there's 20% that's not paid that's up to you so what most people do is they take out some additional insurance that cost you even more money to pay that and so that's called a supplement now when you turn 65 they're going to take away from your Social Security hundred and sixty four dollars and ninety cents so the rest of this video let's just call it hundred and sixty five dollars so happy birthday on your 65th birthday you get to lose hundred and sixty five dollars of your Social Security bummer okay we just got this big bump a year ago of 8.7 percent and now they're gonna take it all away if you're turning 65 this year as I am in December so I had to make the decision I got my Medicare going I started it yesterday it takes effect December 1 and I'll tell you all about that at the end and what I decided to do and what I think is phenomenal I got lucky all right so you turn 65 you get that card you lost $165 and you're still now on the hook for 20% what do you do about that well they say hey <clears throat> these insurance people pay some more and we'll take care of all that they'll take care of all that and you won't have a worry in the world you could get hit by a bus and you don't have to worry about coming up with a dime except the what it costs to buy the insurance how much is that insurance it's a doozy <laughs> it really is it's it's just amazing got the numbers right here and um, forgive me if I put my C rights on if you uh, stay on original Medicare and you take out this insurance that I'm talking about you're going to get uh, one of two plans if you stay on Medicare there's a third plan we're going to talk about later in the video is a G or an N 
They, that's what they call it. I don't know why. That's what they call it. The G is the Cadillac, the best, the best you can get. All you got to do is pay $220 a month in Florida, in my zip code. That's what it costs me. I didn't do it, naturally. $220 a month, plus the $165 a month. But wait, there's more. You got to have prescriptions, right? Or you're going to be needing them eventually because you're getting old. And you're going to need blood pressure, cholesterol. Me, I've got a glaucoma situation with my eyes. I take these eye drops. Where are they at? Let me show you. I get two of them. I got this one, and I got this one, this little green cap. They're about two or $300 a bottle each, twice a day. It's got to do with my pressure in my eyes. So without insurance, you know, I'd go to the poorhouse in a heartbeat, buying that every month, two, $300 a bottle. So you gotta have Part D drugs because that insurance I talked about for $220, that's just to pay that 20% of the doctor bill. Ain't nothing to do with any pills or eye drops. So that's going to cost you uh, a whopping, for the drugs, uh, another $400 a year or basically uh, $33 a month. All right, so $220 a month, $33 a month, $165 a month for the Part B. It's adding up. It's adding up. And the bottom line is, I'll, I'll just cut to the chase with you, that G plan that you don't pay for anything else other than the, other than the cost of a total $5,240.80 a year. $5,240.80 for me here in South Florida. That's adding my 165 a month to Medicare. That's adding my 220 a month to this insurance company to give me the Cadillac. And that's adding um, drugs to cover those bottles of $400 a year or $33 a month. And it also includes, before anything, by, by the way, the Cadillac pays for everything except $226 annual deductible. Yeah, $226. Before it pays, you go to the doctor, you pay $226, and then you don't pay anymore. Or after you give $5,240.80 every year, then you don't pay anymore that year. Now, let's say you don't go to the doctor that year. You're still out $5,240.80. Or, basically... $436.73 a month for the Cadillac. $436.73. Are you in? Are you in? I'm out. I'm out. All right, what's the next What's the next best deal we got? Well, the next best deal they talk about is the letter N, as in Nancy. Well, tell us more, Tim. What's the N about? Oh, the N. It gets much better. Uh, you only have to pay for that one. $164 a month. You still got your $165 a month for the Medicare. You still got the $33 a month for your pill bottle. All right. And you and you pay an annual $226. You still got that. That doesn't go anywhere either. And that one isn't such a Cadillac, meaning if you go to the doctor, there's co-pays. You got to come out with $20 when you go into the doctor for him to diagnose, to have a conversation with you, just to walk in the door at a doctor's office every time, 20 bucks, $50 for an emergency room, but that's all right. You'd be paying all you got if you had to go to an emergency room. Anyway, that one comes down to um, 4000 $568.80, a difference of $672. And you say, Tim, 
which way should I go, G or N? Well, I say N because if you're going to go with the Cadillac and it's the same thing except you got to pay that 20 every time you see the doctor, you're saving annually because this one only costs you $380 a month. You went from 473 to 380 a month. That's uh, $672 less a year, or 33 copays, meaning you could go to the doctor 33 times a year before you would spend the same amount of money at $20 copays to get the exact same insurance. Okay? Anywhere in America where Medicare takes, it's just like the G plan, except they back off a little bit because you pay 20 bucks instead of worrying about nickel and diamond every time you go to the doctor. So I say, if you never go to the doctor, why not save $672 and just stick with the end plan? But they don't talk about that as much because insurance salesmen get a commission and the commission is based on the monthly premium. So all the premiums that cost less mean less commission. So obviously there's a little bit of a, of a motivation to prop up the higher DOS, the higher cost one. And those two are really the same. Only thing is, is you have pay co-pays where the G you don't. And there's another scare tactic that they like to use on the N plan that say, if you go to a doctor and you only have the N plan because he gets a little less from Medicare, that he could charge you 50%, 15% uh, access fee, a excess fee, I'm sorry, excess fee. Nobody does it. I can't speak for every doctor, but I, I would say from what I've gleaned on the internet, very few doctors are going to hit you for the excess fee. But if they wanted to, they could charge you 15% because they took less from Medicare and they're going to try and get it back from you and hit you up. And you're responsible for it above the $20 copay. So, you know, they got that scare tactic, but most don't do it. So I still say get the N over the G, save almost $700 a year, and if you don't even go to the doctor but two or three times, at $20 a copay, you're, you're going to have to go 33 times to spend what the G plan costs. So it's a no-brainer to me. So did I go with that one? Heck no. That one cost $380.73 a month. Uh, -uh. That's 400 bucks basically. $400 less out of my Social Security by buying insurance and them taking their $165. i am out. Well, what else you got, Tim? Well, I searched and searched, and I found another plan called the HDG. It's the High Deductible G Plan. Believe it or not, folks, this plan was only has only been available for, I'm going to guess right now, don't hold me to it, maybe six or eight years now but anyway it's not pitched very much because the premium is only 64 dollars a month you say what do you get this is this is if you're going to carry insurance and you want to stay on medicare and not do the next plan i'm going to talk about that everybody wants to disparage but yet everybody's on it this is the way to go for a insurance supplement plan and staying on uh, the Medicare. You give them your 165. They're going to take that from you. Happy birthday! 165 less for you. And then you get this insurance that's only $64 for me. It might be $40 somewhere else. It might be, it can't be much more than that because I'm in one of the higher states. You say, well, what is it? It's the high deductible G. A G is the Cadillac, remember? Well, the high deductible G is the same Cadillac. What do you mean? How can it be cheaper? Well, there's a deductible. <laughs> there's a deductible of $2,700 every year that you pay. Now, before you say, no, 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 I'm out, listen to me. Listen closely. You know, the original Medicare that you pay the $165 for, they pay 80% of the bill and there's a 20% leftover. That's why you got to buy these insurances. Well, with the G high deductible, 
there's a $2,700 deductible that you pay every year. But don't forget, don't forget, you got that A and B you're paying $165 for. They're going to pay 80% of the doctor bill. And the 80% that they pay is not the high price pay. It's not the cash price pay. It's not the charge they would charge if you walked in the door with no insurance. They're going to charge what Medicare says we'll give you, which is lower, much lower, because Medicare negotiates with these doctors that accept Medicare to take a realistic price. So the doctors agree to it because there's millions of people on Medicare and they want that money. So they bill Medicare 80% and you get billed to 20% of the Medicare adjusted price. But you say, Tim, that 2700 that scares me. Why? You're only responsible for 20% of that visit. Not the $2,700 deductible from get-go. From, G- from January 1 every year, you're not looking to shell out $2,700 first with the high deductible G. You get 80% shelled out by the U.S. government first, and then you pay 20% of that negotiated price up to your 2700 Folks, do you realize what I'm saying? You may never see $2,700 come out of your pocket annually. If you're only going to be paying 20% of the negotiated uh, Medicare price and you only go to the doctor a few times a year, you may only pay what? A couple hundred dollars a year plus your $64 a month. So, and then, and then the 165 so you're at 165 and 64 and that one's going to cost you monthly uh, 261.90. We're getting closer. $261.90. You get less of your social security because you got to give them 165 and then the $64, but you are going to be on the hook for up to $2700, but it's not going to come anywhere near that because you're only going to be responsible on each little time you go. 20%, not 2700 first. Also, think how little $2,700 is if you got hit by a bus. I mean, if you had a major thing, a hip replacement or knee surgery or whatever, and you had to go to the hospital and they paid 80% and you're responsible for 20 of the negotiated price, and the 20% that you're responsible for was, I don't know, five grand, 10 grand, whatever, whatever, maybe a a big hospital bill could be 20 grand. Who knows? You most you're going to most you're going to pay is twenty seven hundred dollars. I say that's a great deal, but nobody wants to talk about it because they don't make much commission on it. But guess what? I got a better deal for you. I didn't go for that either. I said, heck no. Three hundred dollars a month, two sixty one ninety. I'm out. I, I, I get seventeen hundred dollars a month. I want it all. So I said, what else you got? I'm listening. And I'm going to tell you who this great insurance company is, this uh, broker I got that turned me on to this. They sell the other plans, and that's what you'll have to pay. And so for some people, that might be best for them. Maybe they got 301s and pensions and money falling out of their pockets, and they can just go for it. Maybe you already have a lot of health issues, and you want the Cadillac plan. That's up to you folks. But that isn't what I go for. I want to keep all my Social Security because I'm already having to work a side hustle. So what did I get? I asked her, I said, what else you got? And she says, well, you ever heard of that C plan, the Advantage plan? (laughs) Don't turn the video off. You're going to love it. Okay. The Advantage plan. Here we go. I said, well, what's the Advantage plan? Well, the Advantage plan, as you know, all them washed up actors every year, around the end of the year, start promoting the Advantage plan where you get hearing, dental, vision, gym memberships, meal plans, all these extra goodies, and a zero premium. Not $64, not $164, and certainly not $220, zero dollars. And you say, what's not like about that? Not much. So I said, Tell me more. She says, well, how would you like, and this isn't for everybody. I'm lucky. I'm blessed. 
and I'm happy. You could live in a zip code. They've changed it. They've changed some stuff with this Advantage plan because Medicare is trying to get out of paying for all your medical bills. So they pay these insurance companies to off you from them to them and they they take care of all your medical costs. But you got to go within a network. That's no big deal. This is where I live. You know, you got to go to certain hospitals. I don't care. He's an MD and that's a hospital. I'm in. What's the difference between that hospital, that hospital, that doctor and that doctor? They got that degree. They know about this and that. I'm fine with it. I'm not planning on going off in any way. But um, they said, we'll give you $150 back on that $165 that Medicare charges. I said, what? Did I hear you right? That $165, $164.90, the $165 that you have to pay, you don't have to pay. If you take a Medicare Advantage plan with Humana Gold Plus that I got, so I'm getting $150 put back on my uh, 165 they want to take. So now I'm down to $14.90 a month. I'm getting hearing, dental, vision, meal plan, gym membership, and all the other garbage that probably doesn't amount to anything. A teeth cleaning and a, uh, a vision test. Yeah, you know, but it's some, it's there. Uh, you know, a hearing test. What? What'd you say? You know, so, but the pills, the drugs are included. And what they do is she asked me, she said, what drugs are you taking? I said, well, I got the blood pressure and I got the uh, cholesterol. You know, you can get on, you, you can get those so cheap already with GoodRx. It's a free app you can download and buy those for pennies. It's not an expensive medication. So if you don't want to even pay for a, a, a Part D plan and you go with one of the G's or the N's and you want to bring it down even more, you may consider if you're not on the, the eye drops like me, you know, or, or, or other expensive prescriptions, you can get good RX, you know, and get a cheaper price. But it's still not that expensive for the D plan, but you got to pay it, it's extra. But it's included with the Advantage plan, all of it. And my $165, I'm getting 150 back. That's not for every state, that's not for every zip code, but that's what I'm getting. So I crushed it. I got uh, my Medicare for an annual cost of, you ready for this? $14.90 a month times 12 months. Remember the G plan high deductible we talked about with the $2,700 uh, deductible, the maximum out of pocket you could spend? Well, the same thing with the Advantage plan, just like the N plan had them little $20 co-pays every time you go to the doctor. Same thing with the Advantage plan. Every time I go to the doctor, 20, 10, I don't know, maybe 30. Um, 10, $20, I think she told me with a maximum out-of-pocket cost, and I've heard as much as seven, $8,000, $5,000 on these Advantage plans, $3,000, folks. $2,700 for the high deductible G, but that would still cost me $276 a month because I wouldn't be able to get, get out of that $165 a month to the Medicare charge, Part A and B. It's really just the Part B. So, and here's the kicker before I end the video. If in the first year I find out the Advantage plan is actually the disadvantage plan, I can switch before 12 months passes back to the supplement plan with no health questions and join the high, def, high, high definition, high deductible G plan, which is the way I would go. If I'm gonna do a supplement plan, it's not the G, it's not the N, not for Tim, maybe for you. I'm going with a high deductible and pay um, my 165, which I'll have to go back to, and the $64 a month. And I'll be looking at 296. But I'm not looking at much cost every year because the 2700 may never come into play if I'm only responsible for 20% after Medicare pays the 
So this is what you have to consider, folks. The G and the N, I didn't cover this, is going to cost you $5,240.80 a year for the G and $4,568.80 for the N without getting sick, without going to the doctor one time, just for free, just for fun, just for you to give them the money, just for you to pay the 165 to Medicare and the other part to the um, insurance company. And the first $226 after all of that, when you go to the doctor the very first time, $226 more before they pay. So with all the money you can save in five years, if you've paid that, and you forked out $20,000 in insurance, extra insurance and Medicare fees, when you could have been on the Advantage plan, even if you had to pay the 165, maybe, maybe you got a plan that only gives 50 back. Maybe it's 100 back. Maybe it's nothing back, but you still get the drugs included. You still can go to a doctor. You can still go to a hospital. You still can get medical. And you're only looking at a $3,000 to $5,000 maximum out of pocket for a major, major thing. I think you're going to come out better than spending five grand a year, $4,500 a year. And all those healthy years that you don't use it, you're just still spending that money. The money you're saving on the healthy years by the other plan, you can afford to pay, you know, a little more if you had a sick year. So you see what I'm saying? A lot of these things they don't tell you about because it's all about making money today. Everybody wants to make money. I don't blame them. I like making money. But I thought I'd give you what I did. I got $150 back. I'm only paying $14.90 a month for my Part B. The premium is zero for my Advantage plan. I have a $3,000 out of pocket. Zero cost to see my primary. I get a referral if I need to go to the specialist and have my glaucoma checked. I get all my drugs paid, or maybe there's a copay. Maybe there's a deductible. So what? Look what I'm saving. I'm not spending four or five grand a year for medical. This is an excellent deal. I couldn't be more stoked about it. I was so worried about losing my $1,700 and going down $165, plus having to pay insurance every month, which comes to so much a year out of my pocket when all I have is side hustle, part-time work, and Social Security. And even if you have a lot of money, why, why give it away? Why spend it on something that you don't need and gambling, you know? It's kind of like taking Social Security later. You're, you're betting that you're going to live uh, to 100 years old when the average age is only 73 for a male, and you lose 102 grand by not taking your Social Security for five years if you get what I get every month, which is kind of the average. So I would say, folks, you would seriously, seriously want to consider it the company to call to get this great deal and that company is Cardinal Insurance in North Carolina and they have a, a website that's um, cardinalguide.com and they also have uh, a phone number 919-535-8261 and uh, they're also Cardinal Advisors on YouTube. So one more time, check out his videos on YouTube. His name is Hans and his uh, cohort, Tom. And they go over all the plans that you can start studying if you're approaching 65 or before um, you know the uh, enrollment plan begins. Maybe you need to switch your plan and keep the same plan, but a company is less money than you're paying. Maybe you had price increases. Maybe you, there's a, a company they can get you with. They'll look for you. These are workers here at this place. These people are helpers. I called another one. All they did was hound me. Um, Cardinal Advisors on YouTube or go to cardinalguide.com or just call them up at 919-535-8261. They're very, very nice people. And they even have a website and a tool that you can go on to search for prices and without giving your information and they won't bother you. You can go on there anonymously where all the other brokers that tell you to contact them, 
you have to provide some information, your email and your phone number, and believe me, five minutes later they're hounding you and they won't stop because they just want to feed you in to, uh, and Cardinal, they work backwards. They don't say my company first, they say, you know, what plan you want first, and then they shop the companies of who's the best. And they even look at these companies that have rate, had price increases more often than others and say this company, you know, has a better reputation. And every year you can contact them and they will shop for you to see if your price is better, if it went up at another company. So anyway, that's what I did. Sorry the video was so long. I hope it goes viral. Share it with everybody. Please give it a thumbs up so that we'll get a lot of views because all these YouTubers out there promoting uh, the plans, they're not buying a plan. I bought my plan. This is coming from somebody that bought a plan. So give it a thumbs up and crush it.